Well, good evening. We're with Miss Piggy, okay? And I've got a selection of food here, and this is an experiment we're going to do. And this experiment is to be able to find out what parasites in control is because I'm going to show you in a second. They've been watching this food for a little bit, and they're going nuts. They're smelling, okay? And remember, we're talking about parasites here. And we're going to throw in a variety of food. I'll tell you in a second here. But there's a variety of food. There's bananas in here. Well, let's just go over. Whatever they're going to... These are bananas. This is coconut shavings. Okay, they love all this stuff. These are old bananas. This is molasses feed here with, with corn, sweet potatoes. Okay? And, of course, we did a video last night on radiation uh, in, in fish. And I bought this just yesterday. And this thing here, we filleted, and we did a real good video to show you about the radiation in fish. I uh, just went down to the ocean today, too, and was checking the radiation by the ocean. But I want you to look at this thing. Inside the neck, the mongoose, I had it outside, and this thing stinks. And flies are all on it and everything. They cleaned off every piece of meat. Look around the ribs right here. Whoa, looking in the neck, around the neck. Okay, the top of the head. They ate every piece of flesh they could get, like right through there. Oh, okay. Now, I'm going to throw this in last, but I want to show you. Remember, blood eats blood. These guys are not carnivores. They are, but I don't feed them any flesh at all. They've just been having a vegetarian diet. Okay, but let's see what they want to eat. Remember, this is an experiment, and the experiment is they can eat anything they want here first. Let's see what parasite is in control first. Is it going to go ahead and be the stinchy carcass they're going to want to eat? Shoot, you wouldn't eat this thing. <laughs> oh, it stinks. Ugh, been sitting out in the sun all day. Now, <clears throat> I did this on purpose is because this thing stinks. I want to see, remember, this is not fresh. Okay, this is, this is nasty stinky, full of flies all day, and everything's been chewing off it. I'm going to throw up to... Of course, I got a glove on because I can't even stand the smell. So I'm going to throw in, okay, all of this, and I'm going to put this in last. But remember, the question is, what do you think is going to be eaten first? And remember, why is that? Is because, remember, these are mind-controlling parasites. And these parasites that live in the body, and you know that they've got a variety of the pig tapeworm, the whatever pay tapeworm they have in them. Okay, remember, they eat off the dirt. Okay, and if you've got a tapeworm in you, okay, that's blood sucker, and they want blood, and they will drink your blood, okay, inside your body, even if you don't feed them. But if they smell blood, they go nuts like these guys. Now, remember, this is what they eat mostly it's sweet potatoes, okay, and this type of cob seed, okay. And it's not organic, it's just basically it's hog food, okay? And I get these up the street. These are Okinawan purple potatoes, and they're full of protein and stuff. So this is what they eat. And these, of course, are free, given to us. And I'm just going to throw these in there. I'm going to see if they want to eat anything. Okay, look, smells it, doesn't even want to look at it. And you know what they want? I'll tell you. And they don't eat meat. Let's throw all that in there, okay? Okay, now they're going to eat that. Okay, now watch what happens. We're going to go ahead. They're going to change tunes here in a sec. I already know what they're going to do. I'm going to throw this one over there. And they're getting a variety of stuff. Look. Okay. And the real stinky stuff, you know what they do? They roll in it. They don't eat it. They roll in it first. Now here it goes. Watch. I'm going to throw it way over here. See if anybody wants that. Ah. Well, let's see. He's choking over there on the dry food because he's eating it too fast. Yeah, look at you. Look at him. He's going to go throw up. I know. It's stuck in your throat. Run. Get it going. Remember, he's got breathing right now. He's got it stuck in his throat. Look. I know. You ate the dry stuff too quick, brother. Yeah, you're better now. Dead do. You don't want that fish? She didn't smell it yet. She's, let's see what this one smells. And now she's back. Now she's going to go back to it. Let's see. Okay. Oh. Oh. Okay. She can eat anything she wants. And this one hasn't got the taste yet. Because if Nanu knows that she's eating something better than that, then Nanu is going to steal it from her. Because she's the head alpha there. Okay. Look. Ah. Listen to the bone crushing. Oh. Okay, now these guys, remember, have better noses than a bloodhound. They have stronger jaws than a Rottweiler. These are 
very, very strong predators. She's 300 plus pounds. Okay, look at them, chewing the bones down, swallowing everything whole. They're scavengers. You eat the pig, remember that. You guys are eating pig, all I can say is this is what pigs do. They eat anything. Rotten, that's rotten flesh. And they're loving it. Look. Get it, Dua. You like that? Oh, they, look, they got potatoes. <laughs> they got, they got, that's sweet full of molasses, real sweet. Okay, and then they've got this stuff. What she was loving is because that's all our leftover salads, just things I know they love. Look, bananas in there. And they went right to the flesh, not because they like it, because the parasites inside them control them to feed. Remember, there's a hierarchy. We talk about this all the time, a hierarchy of parasites. Oh, oh, look at that, going nuts, eating everything down to the bone. There won't be a piece there. That head, I want to see what they're going to do with that. Okay, so this is the game. The game is real simple. Parasites that live in the body have a hierarchy, okay? Sugar parasites eat last because they're lowest on the totem pole. They're yeast, mold, fungus, and candida, just like a person. Remember, what do you eat first at the table? You eat and drink, you eat dead carcass and drink blood. You eat your meat first. Yes, you do. It's the first thing you want on that table. Let's say you haven't eaten in a couple of days, you're fasting, and you put a smorgasbord out there of food. You got sweet stuff, you got cakes, ice cream, you got maybe soups, you got chicken, fish, you got everything out there that you can imagine on a smorgasbord, a variety of food. And remember, the experiment is, okay, Let's see what parasite feeds first. And I know which one will feed first. The ones that eat meat. They are the highest on the totem pole in the body or the hierarchy of mind controlling parasites. They need to be fed. Look at these guys. They're eating every bone, everything, and they've got all this beautiful stuff sitting here and I want it. Okay? And you guys don't even know what that is. Okay? Never even had fish. They've had to throw a rat in there one time and they ate it. It was a dead rat they got off of a. Uh, off a rat trap, and I just threw it in there just to see what they would do. They're pigs, they rolled in it, and they ate it and fought over this nasty with maggots in it. And I just threw it in there, I figured, ah, oh, they'll just smell it, just because it's an experiment. Remember, pigs, if you're eating pig, guys, I can just tell you this, you're making a big mistake. Remember, the pig is the dirtiest animal in the world. It'll eat anything and anything. Remember, a cow only eats grass, okay? It doesn't eat corn or anything, or wheat or soy, but it's a vegetarian. You eat animals, okay, that are scrappers, then you get all the parasites that live in the pig. Remember, the pig, tapeworm, is bad R's tapeworm. And, and maybe we'll go ahead and put a picture in this, in, in the video here. The pig tapeworm, if you've had pig, and maybe not, it doesn't matter, if you've got an egg and they secrete out two to 300,000 eggs a day, and the pig tapeworm has to go through five different cycles in your body. It starts in your stomach, it goes and bores out into the small intestine to the liver. It goes to the liver, makes a house of babies, and then it goes back into the bloodstream. And it goes to your brain. Okay, you got lesions in your brain. You got certain things on x-rays. These are the tapeworms. They control different parts of your body by having children that this thing, this alien, goes in different parts of your body. It goes in the liver, makes babies, goes back in the bloodstream, goes into the brain maybe for next, and makes babies. Then once it's made babies in there, remember, it's making a colony. It's like a bee. It goes into your heart, makes babies. It goes into your gonads, makes babies. Wow, this thing's a machine. I know. And then it comes back around into your lungs, and you, <clears throat> you cough it up, you get cold, you think it's a fever, you think it's, you got a sickness, and this is the last cycle of the pig tapeworm, the last cycle of the beef tapeworm, the last cycle of the fish tapeworm. These things have cycles in your body, they don't just come in your stomach. If you see something, say something.